Hello friends, welcome to Brain Amplifier and our topic of discussion today is skin effect and I want you to consider and listen to each of my words very carefully in this discussion. So what is skin effect? In skin effect, um, the current um, flow only on the surface of the conductor, not in the core of the conductor, while in the DC, the current uh, distribution throughout the, this conductor is uniform. So the skin effect occur only in the AC supply. Now to start the discussion, we have to consider a few things. Suppose this is the conductor. This is the conductor and this is carrying a current capital I. Now, if we see, let us assume that this conductor is made up of very thin, uh, very thin layers. These layers, are, these are the annular rings. So let us suppose that these annular rings are infinitely small and infinitely small distance apart. And let us assume there are n numbers, uh, n number of such rings. And each of these rings carrying a current small i. So if there are n number of rings carrying a current small i, the total current will be capital I. Now we know that if there is some current carrying conductor then there will be magnetic field around this conductor and the direction of those magnetic fields will be find out through the right hand corkscrew rule so if this is the direction of current the direction of magnetic field lines will be such in such in the direction of my fingers so here it will be outward and here it will be inward so suppose this is the annular some this is some annular ring carrying a current small i so due to this annular ring the magnetic field lines will be outside this annular ring so if uh, this is the annular ring we are considering the field lines will be uh, confined throughout this conductor if this is the annular ring we are consider considering the field lines will be throughout this area okay not in the inside of this and if we are considering the outermost annular ring the field lines will be only outward and they will not be confined inside this area so if we have understood till here then we'll go to the next step now here comes into the picture two more effects those are eddy current effect and the lenz's law now what is eddy current if suppose this is the current carrying conductor now we have to understand why this occur only in ac not in the dc so in ac will be having this changing current and that changing current will be producing a changing magnetic field so if the current direction at some moment the direction of current is in that di this direction the magnetic field lines will be say, such such this that is outward here and inward here now what eddy current says that if we put some conductor this is my conductor if we put some conductor into some changing magnetic field then that magnetic field that changing magnetic field sorry will induce a current in that conductor okay now the direction of that current induced in that conductor will be such that this will oppose this changing magnetic field okay A according to lenz's law so we have not, uh, we have to understand lenz's law as well as eddy current so if we consider the if we were uh, let us explore the direction of eddy current suppose this is my conductor this is my conductor and uh, th this is the magnetic field so at some moment if the magnetic field is increasing in this direction then okay if the magnetic field is increasing in this direction in this direction so the eddy currents will be introduced in such a way that these will produce a, a, the, a counter magnetic field which will be in this direction so to produce a magnetic field in that direction the direction of current should be according to my fingers so the direction of current here will be like this though so this these will produce a counter magnetic field in that direction this is the eddy current so the these will produce a back emf kind of thing now if we put all these things and sum up on our conductor this is my conductor this is carrying a total current capital i so if at some moment the direction of magnetic field lies in this direction that is here and here the direction these are this is the direction of magnetic field lines due to all the annular rings inside this circle all annular rings inside the circle are producing a magnetic field lines in this direction so due to this magnetic and uh, you know that these magnetic field lines are not in the air but these are confined to the conductor so a conductor is placed in these changing magnetic field lines so obviously these will produce an eddy current and that eddy current will produce a counter emf how this will produce a counter emf take this uh, this position at this point 
the direction of uh, uh, magnetic field lines is in this direction so if the direction of magnetic field lines in this direction then the eddy currents will be produced in such a way that these will oppose this direction of magnetic field lines so the eddy currents will be introduced in this direction so that the, these can produce a counter emf uh, counter magnetic field in that direction so if i focus here the magnetic field lines will be uh, as you can see this uh, orange circle the magnetic th this is the direction of this counter emf this is my counter emf now if you see one thing <coughs> this is my counter emf and i have this is the direction of my current and this is my the direction of my eddy current so inside this annular ring this eddy eddy current will be opposing this my net current and uh, outside it is supporting so if we sum up the uh, do the vector sum uh, that inside this annular ring my net current will be reduced and outside the net current will be increased so we can see here that in the core section the net current will be less and in the outside the current will be more so this is the skin effect this this cannot occur in dc because there do, we do not have changing magnetic field so we cannot have the eddy current so due to the eddy current a back emf is introduced uh, in the center of the core and that will oppose the current and that will increase the net uh, net re reactance of the conductor inside the core so the current will flow only on the outer surface and not in the inside. Thank you so much.